Good afternoon, everyone. This is Coach Shimanik with Twa Training, and I want to go over why footwork is a myth and why your kid needs to get stronger to get faster. Now, this topic fires me up, so I'm, there might be a little language in this one because I get a little excited. Number one thing, why footwork is a myth, is because in order for your athlete to get faster, they need to get stronger. Now, I'm talking about high school athletes. I'm not necessarily talking about college kids that have had a really good base of weightlifting or those genetic freaks that are just, you know, they step out the door and they're world-class athletes. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about when I get a phone call and I got a parent that says, you know, oh, you know, little Johnny or little Sally doesn't need to get stronger. They need to work on their footwork. Nothing pisses me off more than when a parent tells me that their kid just needs footwork and then they bring in some fucking 150 pound wet noodle that's pretending to be an athlete. That's just, oh, makes me see red. So, your kid does not need to work on their footwork. Your kid needs to get stronger to be able to handle their own body weight. So, let me back up a little bit. There's two ways that your kid can get faster. They can either stay at a baseline of strength and lose weight so that this baseline of strength has an easier time moving this body weight. Or they can stay at this body weight and get stronger so that this strength level can move this body weight. That's it. It's that simple. There's no magical footwork program with ladders and cones that will make your athlete faster. They need to get stronger. Ladders and cones will get your athlete better at ladders and cones. Okay? Let me illustrate. How does a kid move faster on a field? or a court, or on the ice. They change direction faster, they accelerate faster, and they decelerate faster. That's it. You know, reaction does play a point, but we're talking just purely the physical part of it, not the mental. Okay, when you have an athlete that's coming in to change directions, as they come in, they have to absorb and redirect. How do they absorb and redirect better? They get stronger in that leg. When you're coming in to decelerate, Backpedal, accelerate, how do they do that better? They get stronger. More force application means a faster moving athlete. Force application comes from stronger muscles. That's all it takes. When I hear, you know, we just want to get footwork done. We want to just work on their speed and agility. That tells me that they don't want to do the hard stuff like squatting, deadlifting, single leg squats. That stuff sucks. That's hard work. Hard work is what it takes to get better. Do the work.